Hi, I'm Madison Honeyman, and I'm a senior from Westside High School. This is, <laughs> and this is my poem, False Assumptions. Have you ever met someone so happy and full of life? Their smile can just light up a room. They make corny jokes that you just can't husk. The person you go to when you're having a bad day and you just need a hug. And then you find out the truth. How they struggle with their own mental illnesses, that their smile every day is a mask they wear so you're not worried. Have you ever met someone so scared to tell you what's wrong? Because you're in enough pain already. They're teased and laughed at. Nothing they do is good enough to the standards put there by society. But, they never, but you never see them without a smile. My father's daughter has every reason to not be strong, but she is. She has stories to tell, but instead bites her tongue and blames it on allergies. She's the only one that thinks too much and falls too easily. My father's daughter has stories to tell, but is too scared. She remembers how mommy's drinks were always off limits. She can recall the moments of being pinned against the wall by her throat. The memory of her finally looking for help but was pushed away still haunts her because nobody listens to her anyways. She remains the middle child, the only one with brown eyes, as if fighting to be heard isn't enough. She struggles with voices in her head, diagnosed with depression, anxiety, bipolar. They say she's angry, but she refuses to throw a pill at it. Crying in silence is just easier. In the last three years, my father's daughter has lived in six different homes because methamphetamine and alcohol are better children. He won't admit it's a problem because she's seen, she's seen a courtroom in person more times than on TV. She tells herself it'll change, but it's just a reoccurring nightmare. She's 17. She shouldn't worry about where she sleeps at night, whether there's dinner on the table. My father's daughter shouldn't worry about the statistic of 98% chance of becoming like him. I know that pain. False assumptions embedded in my mind allow me to reintroduce myself.